That ball's caught by Keelan Cole to the goal line, touchdown! Luke fires middle of the field, that ball's caught for the touchdown! Keelan Cole, ball is caught in the corner of the end zone, and it's a touchdown! In the corner of the end zone, Keelan Cole for the score! And I think he got it both feet down, that's complete to Cole, and Cole is in for a touchdown! Rifles the middle, touchdown! Wow. Oh my goodness, Keelan Cole! He's coming off a career high in receptions, a career high in receiving touchdowns, and he had the longest punt return in the entire NFL in 2020. He is now a New York Jet. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Keelan Cole to Good Morning What's up, Keelan? Football. Keelan, what's, what's up? So, what's up? How y'all doing? Hey, yo. We're doing great. We're excited to have you. We see some sort of skyline behind you. It could be Jersey City, could be New York, but you are fully now there in Jersey <laughs> with the Jets. And it's yes, not sir. just you in that receiver's room that's new. You also add Elijah Moore, the rookie. There's Corey Davis. Jets fans have been wondering, what are we getting from these wide receivers? You're a couple weeks into minicamp. Can you give us a sneak peek on what they can be anticipating? Uh, just, just be ready for explosives. Be ready for excitement. Be ready for playmaking. Uh, that's really all. Okay, so okay. You mentioned do, uh, like, explosiveness. Okay, I, I hear you. Explosiveness, playmaking. Um, you know, you 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 mentioned the the receivers that you guys have. Peter mentioned them. Corey Davis, Elijah Moore, yourself. Um, this does have the potential to be one of the top wide receiver cores in the business. So, a couple of questions, two parter. One, how do you separate yourself from the pack, and how do a group of wide receivers help a young quarterback? See, and that's the thing with the, like, we, we all have different types of attributes, so we can't really separate ourselves in order for us to do good. So, and then that goes along with the next question, just us being together as one and doing all of our parts when Zach's ready. That's that's us being there for him. That is us being there for him. Uh, whether it's uh, Elijah going underneath with a little short throw and taking it to 80, or is with Corey mushing somebody mm -hmm. and on a, on a short little hitch and going, or it's me running past the defense, or anybody, or Mims jumping over everybody, right. you know, it's, it, everybody's has their own little thing, but we're still trying to learn from each other so that way we can all become one room and one receiver room, so that way every time he throws the ball, we're ready. And I hope that happens by week 16 when you already know, don't you? Jackson Jags come into town to <laughs> MetLife, your old squad, that'll be, uh-huh, I know you know. Number one overall pick up against Those are my guys. Those are my guys. Pick, but hey, I think it's, it's a just, hey, it's mm, Keelan it's Cole revenge <laughs> game. Um, I'm going to ask you about your coach. A uh, lot of youth on the team. A lot of people in the NFL, a lot of fans don't know Robert Sala. I don't know how he is on the field. Describe to me your head coach and what he's like on the practice field. Uh, observant. Like, you really never see him. <laughs> until at the end and then he tells you all that's going on and everything that's been happening and you be like dang where was you at during the day but uh like just like it's just always paying attention uh being detailed with stuff even when he's coaching you when he brings you to the side he, he lets you know what he's seen so that way you can get better within the practice and not just waiting afterwards he wants to see improvement all the time as quick as possible so uh observing is the best word i can come up with that it's so exciting to see him and to see you. And I, I love that you, your positivity that you have, you're killing you. I love you point out that the Jaguars are still your guys and you obviously love playing with them. It shows in your Instagram feed. If anybody just swipes through it, they're going to see a lot of pictures. They're also going to see a recurring slogan that you have that says pro is the goal. Pro is the goal. Pro is the goal. It goes back a long ways. How did this start? And what exactly does this mean? Tell us the story of pro is the goal. Well, it really started with uh, me and my uh, freshman roommate, um, Cody Mills, shout out. Uh, we was just sitting there, and we, we both played football, and we was just like, like, what are we doing this for? And so it was like, I, I mean, we ain't about to do this just to be done when we, when we get done. So we did the pro as a go. So ever since then, we was like, if we're doing this to go to pro, we're going to have to do it, and we're going to do it together. And we just kept fighting and, and working until one of us got – anything out of it we know that the chances were yeah. slim but it was good to see everybody winning from me making it because of the hard work i put in with them no doubt about it well said now you're going into your fifth season right and as someone as a show who 
watches a ton of highlights. Um, we're familiar with Odell Beckham's, you know, one-handed catch up against the Cowboys, but I wanted to talk about one of your sensational one-handed snags. Let's take it back to <laughs> 2018 against the Patriots. The ball seemed uh, to be stuck in your hand as soon as it hit. What in the world was going on with this catch? Break this down, fam. Well, I mean, earlier that practice, I mean, earlier that week in practice, I actually had one of the same attempts, but it was raining. And when I came down, I hit the ball on his helmet. So that is what made me reach out and be more secure with it because I actually kind of went through the situation in a different way. But that was that was a little small little story that nobody really knew about. But honestly, I'm not really a back shoulder type of guy. When it, I mean, that year at least. So I wasn't expecting that at all. I was expecting to beat him over top and, and went for the touchdown. And then I looked up, the ball was there, just reacted. It's an insane catch. Oh, and crazy. we're so excited to see you wear those Jets colors and make similar ones mm. to them. Uh, we just got word that you've never been to Manhattan proper. Is that true? Can you still have never <laughs> been to Manhattan? Yeah, I, ain't, I live right across the street and never been. Uh, I love this. I love this. So, so we are going to put you on the clock for a segment we do on our show called A New York Minute. It's one minute and you have to answer as many questions as you can in rapid fire procession. Are you ready? Funny. Uh, yeah, Let's right. go. All right. The first thing that Keelan Cole Let's wants go. to do in Manhattan is what? I kind of want to just go uh, to a nice movie scene and reenact the movie. Okay, oh. I, I'm picturing what oh, Casablanca. Okay. What are we looking at here? What? What's I don't scene? really know movies. But <laughs> did you I am Legend, about? Home Alone. No, is that? Is, I, uh, I was thinking like Pets. Oh yeah, Secret Life of Pets. <laughs> pets. I love that. Secret Life of Great. Pets. Or Home Alone. Right, he loves it. No, number two, Knicks or Nets? Who are you rolling with if you're a New Yorker? I heard I was supposed to go with the oh. Knicks. I mean, not the Knicks, the Nets. What do, you think? Give me what, you heard. what do you think? What do you think? I mean, I heard it's Jets, Mets, Nets. It makes sense. Oh, okay, okay. It. I like that. Oh, Jets, yes. Mets. All right. Yeah. The most yeah. famous New Yorker alive is who? Uh, Jay Z. Jay Z. That's great. Oh, That's okay. all right. Yeah, yeah, That's good. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. I like that. I like yeah, that. Great. Last one. Your one teammate that you would love seeing on the panel as a guest on Jimmy Fallon's Tonight Show would be who? <laughs> Corey Davis. Corey Davis? He's got he's got some personality. <laughs> no. It's <laughs> <laughs> good. Oh, that's, that's good. funny. That's awesome. <laughs> Feeling good stuff, man. This is awesome. Welcome to New York. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, we appreciate you, man. Yeah, man. Hey, have me back. Well, I'll be let here. me ask you quickly, Keelan. Okay. Before we right. leave, do you believe that a kangaroo, do you believe that a kangaroo is an elite mammal? Uh oh, what's he doing? What's he doing? Whoa, whoa, what? Oh! what? Oh! Oh! Yes, yo! No! Yes. He brought the house oh. down! Yes. Kangaroo what? Is the best tell, me, tell me everything I need to know. Why kangaroo? Tell, tell us. Ever. Kangaroo is the best animal ever. It's like, I don't really know how they explain. Like, they have so many type of, like, they're so diverse that yeah. they're so, like, they're very smart and within their environment and they do a lot. Like, think about it. You've never really seen a kangaroo, but they're big. <laughs> so how, it's like, they're, that's the smartest thing. They, like, they get they get around and they're not a predator, but they're not anybody else's prey. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, there, there's a lot of hidden Talk about facts about it. kangaroos that don't nobody really know that I really don't know that I've been trying to find out. That it's just facts not out oh, there great. about it. You're a legend, Keelan. Did he just get that tattoo this morning? That, that is, was incredible. No. <laughs> <laughs> Am I other than a bull? That's, that's the only awesome. animal so, that I got. Uh, that's, that's so good. So on, I that's love dope, it. Bro. Keelan, you have four of, you we know, appreciate you've you, been man. in the NFL hey, a while. We love you a lot. We I'll send, send you. Me that. Send me that. <laughs> We wish you right, so Kayla. much luck. Uh, Thank you. Get to Manhattan and then maybe go down under. Keep going and go to Australia. Once you yeah. tackle Joe's Pizza in Manhattan, we'll be back. Hey, just tell everybody football. Manhattan. Is the kangaroo just elite? Lead me to the right way. Just when I walk right, over, just lead me to the right yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. Tell everybody. New Yorkers <laughs> are nice. New Yorkers are nice.
We, we'll show you some spots. Triggs and I, and Peter and uh, I'm a, Peter and Kyle. I'm willing and to. Okay, I'm we have to go. We have to go. All right, all right, bye. Not all right. what I heard. <laughs> Keelan, we love you. So fun. Bye, Keelan. We love you.